Jason Govan died on the streets of Denver five years ago, but he was not forgotten, not in the last few months of his life, when a mystery woman would bring him food and coffee. And he's not forgotten now by his mother, Candace, who is determined to find that woman and offer her her thanks. Candace Govan, who lives in Rhode Island, spoke with our photojournalist, Mike Grady. Tell me about Jason. He was an excellent, excellent artist. He copied Salvador Dali. That was his idol. That's my son, Jason. There's a picture above my head. Can you see it all right? Yeah, I see it. Okay, well, that's Jason. He had started um, picking up a bad habit. He started drinking. So he became homeless. It was December 26th, 2017. And I walked in the house and my husband tell, told me, you better sit down. And he said, well, they, they found Jason the day after Christmas or in an alley, I guess it was in an alley near a dumpster. And uh, he had died from hypothermia. There was a woman who was coming to feed him and give him coffee. I guess she worked there in the office building next door. So it was probably downtown somewhere. Yes, yeah, it was, yeah, it was, it was downtown, yes. I see in my note here that it was between Lincoln and Sherman Street. Yes, yes. So that's what I've been trying, I don't know her name. I've been trying to get a hold of her. Um, I just wanted to thank her. I wanted to tell her a little bit about him. What would it mean to you to be able to talk to this person who you knew? It would mean an awful lot to me. It would mean an awful lot to me. I'm just hoping that somebody sees us and thinks, hey, there's somebody out there I know that's always on that corner. I want to give that person something. If you have any idea who might have helped Jason, please email us at next at 9news.com and we'll get you in touch with his mom.